And now, the interview you've all been waiting for on the Elite Bad Boy channel. Featuring the story of Amy Smith, the former lover of Stephen Steve Nice and Davis. Please listen on to the following documentary. Hi, my name is Amy. I am a former lover of Steve Davis, and in this documentary, I tell all about the man you know and love including his obsession with football, cream cakes and kebabs. I admit he was a legend but his cheesy feet were too much for me. Thanks for being here to date Amy. Okay, so first can we ask you how you met Steve Davis? <laughs> Steve was in a nightclub called Cherries in Northwest England and he came up to me and just asked me to dance. He had a white tuxedo suit on, and bleached blonde hair. He had a hot dog in his hand and a Manchester United program in the other. I had just come over from the United States and was new to the nightclub scene in England, Steve, or Boo. As I used to call him put both the program and hot dog on the top of his head and we danced on the dance floor. After about five minutes we went and sat down in one of the booths next to the bar and that's when Steve broke down and told me he was addicted to fatty food and that he couldn't stop eating it. <laughs> he then threw up all over me and my hair smelt of carrots. It wasn't a good start to a relationship but Steve so much reminded me of my dog Ralphie that I just thought he was so cute. Amongst all the vomit there was a legend screaming to get out. It was reported that you and Steve had a strange obsession of throwing each other through glass windows and off balconies. Can you confirm this is true? <laughs> yes, I confirm this is true. Mostly when we were intoxicated, we did this. It was a thrill-seeking experience, but Steve had this even stranger obsession of eating his own toenails clippings and sprinkling red sauce on them. He also used to pinch cream cakes from the local cake shop. On one occasion he held up the shop with a toy gun and a mask on. The shopkeeper knew it was Steve, and took pity on him and handed over the cakes. Steve was a very strange individual. Is it true that Steve has the cheesiest feet in Britain and is that what split you up? Steve was a beautiful man, but the moment he took his cheesy socks off he became ugly. I tried in vain to get him to wash them, but he refused saying they were a part of his complex personality. I'm afraid we are going to...